Mr. Lawrence here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to demonstrate a very simple video tutorial on the rate of reaction. So I have hydrogen peroxide with me and this is enzyme catalase. So our research question is how will changing hydrogen peroxide concentration affect the rate of reaction and the gas which is produced will be oxygen because when hydrogen peroxide reacts with catalase, oxygen gas will be produced. And the oxygen gas which is produced now will be measured using two sensors. One is gas pressure sensor, which is from vernier, and the other one will be oxygen sensor. It's also from vernier now. So earlier on I have 30%, I diluted it down to 3% of hydrogen peroxide concentration and I do a twofold dilution. Twofold dilution is 3% to 1.5 0.75 all the way down. So this is most concentrated, this is least concentrated. I prepare the same test tube size. This is my enzyme now. So research question is, how will changing hydrogen peroxide concentration affect the rate of oxygen gas production between hydrogen peroxide with catalase? And we're going to measure it using sensor, gas pressure sensor and oxygen sensor, which I will demonstrate in my second part of my video tutorial. So for this part now, so I'm going to use a micro pipette, which is one mil micro pipette. I'm going to take out three percent of hydrogen peroxide and put inside this little test tube here. And this little test tube here fits into the gas pressure sensor. Put it in. Make sure it's completely airtight. When oxygen gas is produced, pressure will build up. There will be a pressure change over time. That will be the rate of reaction. Okay. Repeat again. Hydrogen peroxide. I'm going to add a bit of catalase oxygen gas will be produced and there will be a pressure build up and it will be measured using gas pressure sensor so this is down I'm going to add about 5 mil into this test tube 1 mil 2 3 4 5 5 mil of hydrogen peroxide at the enzyme which is catalase catalase here micro pipette 10 microlit so volume will all be the same but only the different concentration will be used so I'm going to just only going to demonstrate only one three percent of hydrogen peroxide with the same amount of catalase enzyme so I'm going to use fix it to 10 microlit small amount 10 microlit this is 10 microlit and I'm going to add into this hydrogen peroxide. Once added into it and immediately you got to capture it because the pressure will build up. Okay. Oxygen gas will be produced immediately. So I'm going to add this in. Just add this in. Okay, and immediately close this part. Okay, once we close this part, oxygen gas will be produced. So we can see effervescent gas is produced and that gas is oxygen gas. And it will be measured using gas pressure sensor. And another part of the experiment is we're going to put the hydrogen peroxide into this big container. Same one, we're going to use greater volume, maybe 15 or 20 mL add about 100 microlit of catalase and measure the pressure build up using oxygen sensor because this is the oxygen sensor it fits into this container so next part of my video tutorial I'm going to show you how you're going to measure measure the pressure build up using vernier or logical and this is the end of the first part of my video tutorial thank you